Hi all, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your daily reading for Thursday, February 22nd. This is for all signs. This is a daily energy for today. May not resonate with everybody. I think I'm going to do it this way today. I don't know why. I feel like I need to just pick a card. I'm not sure why, but I have to go with whatever I think. We're going to go with this one. Oh, we got two. Okay. We'll use two. Obstacles. Obstacles. Unexpected obstructions. Frustration. Difficulties. Feelings of hopelessness. Struggle. Discouragement. <laughs> Wonderful. Not a good way to start the day. But we have to remove obstacles to move forward, okay? So anything that comes into your life unexpectedly that causes a hurdle usually needs to be removed, okay? You may act in frustration, you may see this as a difficulty, and you may feel like this is a hopeless situation, but trust in the divine plan that this is meant to be removed. This obstacle has shown up to remove something from your life that is no longer necessary. Opposition. Obstacles and opposition. Opposite viewpoints. Personal differences. A communication gap. Disharmony. Misunderstand misunderstandings and estrangement. So today is a day of obstacles and opposition. Very, very interesting. And as you know, I've used this deck quite a bit. Okay? I have. I've used it in all of my spirit messages and with several private readings. So today is a day of obstacles and opposition, okay? Perhaps, you know, there is another person in your life that there are some disagreements with and you may be feeling frustrated, you may be feeling hopeless, you may be feeling discouraged and um, unheard. You know, I feel like somebody is, isn't hearing the other side. They don't want to hear it. They're considering that an obstacle. You know, there's a lot of um, disharmony here today. And I do apologize, but if that's what the message is, that's what it is. Um, there, there could certainly be a feeling of, of I need to, I need to get away. I need to quit. I need to remove myself from this situation. And in some, t in some instances, that is the best approach to just remove yourself from any negative um, situation. Um, silence speaks volumes. Okay, just remember that silence speaks volumes. Um, there's, there is. There is probably some personal differences between you and another that you may be called to, to step into someone else's reality for a moment. Okay? So try to really consider the other person's reality at this time. All right? As hard as that may be, um, there is a need to um, compromise. Okay? Things may get a little uncomfortable, okay? Things may get a little uncomfortable today. You may be feeling like you're up against the world, like it's, it's, it's ten against one or, you know, one against one or two against one. Either way, it feels like there's definitely um, a need to fight, a need to stand up. I need to stand up for myself. You may be feeling like uh, you're... 
you're ready to quit. Like I said earlier, you're growing weary. You're growing weary in this situation. You may have a lot of doubt and fear. Maybe somebody is trying to instill that into you. Maybe they're trying to bring you, to make you doubt, to make you fear them. Maybe that's what this is. It feels as though you are being presented with some obstacles and some struggles today that are acting you to or asking you to step outside of your comfort zone and face your fears use your inner strength use your confidence remember how far you've come um show your determination in this situation your determination to compromise to work it out Yeah, okay. So here we have the Ten of Swords. We have the uh, Princess of Cups and the Princess of Rings. This is the Princess of Coins, Discs, Pentacles, whatever. It appears that things are pretty... Um, let me get this get zoomed in. There's a completion, okay? There's something that needs to end. There's something that needs to end so that you can that you can go down a different road, so that you can build a new foundation. I feel like you are being tested today. Your strength and your stamina and your determination and your free will and everything, you are being tested. Today is a test of your ability to stand strong, okay? I, and act on your desires. Today is a day of following your own path with conviction. That's what I see. I feel as though you are going to be presented with some sort of obstacle, opposition, um, that makes you use your inner force within to prevail. You know what I mean? To prevail in any way that's necessary for you. Sometimes prevailing is absolutely walking away, okay? Sometimes prevailing is is stepping into that other person's reality. I once took a course, How to Deal with Difficult People. Um, and the way to deal with difficult people is to let them think they won. Seriously. So maybe that's what today is about, is letting this other person think they won and you actually are the winner because... There's there's no more animosity. There's no more fight. There's it's over, it's over. So I feel, and it is over. It's over. This is the ten of swords. Something is coming to a completion today, uh, via an obstacle. Okay, it, it it allows you to remove something that no longer serves you. So I believe that today is a day that really brings a little bit of security to your life, but it doesn't show up as a security in the beginning. Okay, I feel like this is good news. It's unexpected, and it doesn't come about. It doesn't start out as good news. Okay, it's going to come in as a struggle. It's going to come as in as a struggle, and it's going to leave positively. So, and I know that's hard. Obstacles and opposition bring in lessons that help us to grow on our journey, that help us to clear away things, that help us to, that remind us of who we are, what we want, blah, 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 blah. I feel like today is a day where we are presented with something that we consider an opposition. We consider it a... Uh, a problem when it arises, when it happens. It's like, oh my God, I can't believe this just happened. How am I going to handle this? But by the end of it, it turns out to be a blessing in disguise. And it, it allows us to let go of something that needed to needed to go. Okay? Because this Ten of Swords is, is a completion. Perhaps you felt like you were defeated but the fact of the matter is, it's over. It's over. This isn't, it isn't, it isn't a defeat. It isn't. It was a lesson, okay? These, I feel as though you will be given the chance to face these obstacles that have been hindering you and holding you back. And at first thought, it may be a struggle. But in the end, it will be a release.
and that's what I have. 